tune in for. This is why I love Ladies and gentlemen, today. please welcome from Costa Rica, Alex Cambranero. So Alex is actually one of my competitors, uh, one of my athletes, I should say. So Alex had a, um, a good, strong win. He went from 212 last year, um, weighing in at sort of 194 pounds. So it made a, a selective choice to step into the classic division. I feel that it was a really good fit for him. Yes, he dropped down. I remember, uh, did he win the Chicago win, win the trip? He No, he actually he won Pittsburgh. Uh, Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh. That's right. Mm -hmm. And he was and second in New York. Right. Not he, not yeah, second it. in New York. Coming in from the 212 uh, down to classic was a very good move for Alex there. Neil, you work with him. Tell us about the, the neck condition that, that that's going on with him. I think he's had an injury in the past and a nerve impingement. So right. if his, his head goes straight, it impacts his vision. And oh. uh, for me personally, I find it pretty frustrating because a lot of co people comment about his, his neck tilted, tilted. as opposed to looking at his physique. Yeah. Because he is a great athlete. No, there's no question. There's just a lot of people have that question wanting to know its origins. Kind of tilts his head to the one side all the time. Now, what... What did you do from one show to the next to get him in this Olympia shape? It was just basically a manipulation of food. I took him out of the gym quite a bit, to be honest with you, because we dieted for quite some time, because obviously going into the Pittsburgh Pro, going into the New York Pro, took him out of the gym for quite some time, and then obviously we slowly transcended back into, obviously, pre-contest prep for this show. Well, Neil, I'm not a trainer, but I, uh, I recommended that he drop down into this classic physique. And uh, I'm taking credit for that. Now that you are, have him on the straight and narrow, he's at the big show. He was a long ways away from actually arriving here, and he's representing very well. But last year we came in as 212. We placed eighth, which is an amazing place. And seeing he was only 194 pounds wow. at five foot seven, he's giving away like 16, 18 pounds. I turned muscle. pro at that weight. Yeah. Now, how much can he carry at that height? He's up to his maximum now, okay. 192. And you know what? He doesn't need any more. If he goes any more, you go into the bottom of the 212. This is where he belongs. Healthy. Looks very good. With the IFBB Pro League opening up this division, it's obviously opened up the ability for athletes to choose and step into a classic right, seat.